The VC Expert System Results page. After completing the symptom collection and clicking on Solve, the results page appears. Immediately visible are the candidate remedies ordered by descending score and the repertorization info list. This list contains indications and warnings about your repertorization. Clicking on the plus signs displays more information and suggestions to the user for proceeding in the analysis and improving the repertorization. Above the candidate remedies list there are four tabs. Here on the first tab you can see all of the proposed remedies. Click large to see only the large proposed remedies. Click small to see only the small proposed remedies. Click notable to see remedies that are below the fifth position of the proposed remedy list yet in cases where the required remedy proves difficult to confirm might require some attention because they may have one or more keynotes or important symptoms within your case analysis. Click All to see the full list of the proposed remedies again. Based on, not present. To the left of a remedy, click the plus icon to see the analysis of this specific remedy suggestion. In order to see the remedies of a based on or not present rubric, click on this arrow located on the left of each rubric. The symptoms on which the proposed remedy is highly dependent on appear in red. Now, in our case example, on Brionia alba, the first remedy in our proposed remedy list, you will see that this proposed remedy score is based on these five rubrics. Stomach stone, sensation of. Stomach, walking, while. Abdomen, pain, hypochondria, right. Stomach, pain, cramping, gripping, constricting. Generalities, cold, aggravation. Under the Not Present title, you can also see that this proposed remedy does not contain the rubric Mind Irritability, Morning, Rising, After. Next to each of these based on rubrics, you can see the degree you have given for this rubric in your case analysis in your symptom list and next to that the remedy degree in the repertory. To the right of a remedy, you can click the book icon to consult the Materia Medica, which will open in a new window. Similarly, any visible remedy name can be clicked to open the Materia Medica. Adding a prescription. When the user has decided which remedy to prescribe, the fields at the bottom of the results page can be filled with the remedy name and the prescription details, such as potency. Click the remedy name you want to prescribe and the remedy will be entered automatically in the remedy text field. Alternatively, type the name in the field and select from the displayed remedies. Next to it, add the prescription details and click on Save Prescription. Then read the disclaimer and if you agree, click I accept. As you can see, you are back in your case overview page and you can now see the recorded prescription in your case history pane. To print your prescription, click on the prescription and then on Print Prescription. Add in the Prescription Details text field any further instructions you need to give your patient. Click on Print.